Hello, hello everybody. How are you? How are you doing? I hope everybody is doing well, staying safe, stay and health healthy. Uh, so this is my second week doing this live streaming in my studio in Boston. Since we don't have any gigs right now, nobody has gigs. Nobody can go out. So. You know, but I thought it's good to have uh, keep my routine going every Friday, every Saturday. I used to play, you know, every Friday. I mean, I don't want to say I used to play, you know, I usually play um, the Mad Monk Fish on Friday night. Hello, Jamie. Hello, Jamie Chantla. I hope he's watching. And Saturday night, Le Zigomats, uh, French restaurant. So I really miss playing there. And I miss my routine. I miss seeing my friends. Um, you know, I, I miss seeing people. <laughs> it's kind of weird. You know, I go for a walk. At least go for a walk outside. And I don't see anybody really outside either. It's like, you know, it's kind of weird. It's like a movie or something. It's like a ghost town. And if you see somebody, it's like, oh, somebody's here. I gotta, I gotta cross the street I don't want to be close I shouldn't be close to people right so anyway um, I want to play some music so you feel like you are you know at the club you're coming to see me every week and you know we decided doing it from last week so this is our second week and you know hopefully this won't be too long but at least something I can do so, and if you can comment anything on my page, um, Facebook, I can't see right now, but I really appreciate, I want to see everybody's doing well. So feel free to comment as much as you want to. So uh, I'm going to play first song by Bob Degen, great pianist, Bob Degen, it's called Courage.
was Courage by Bob Dylan. Ah, so playing solo piano is a challenge for me. It's, you know, I always play with my trio and it's, to it's totally different, you know, the way I play. I have to change the way I play. So it's a challenge, but um, I like it. I like doing it and, you know, I have to be challenging something new anyway. So, but especially playing this piano, you know, I love my piano, this guy. I'm calling some reason, man, somehow he, he this is he. <laughs> my, uh, <laughs> my great tuner, Austin Grimes. Austin Grimes, he's an amazing person, amazing piano technician. He actually helped me to get this piano from Harvard University. Um, they gave it just to me. So I love this piano and this piano is already, when I got it, it was already like 90 years old or something. And I just like the sound so much and we became really good friends right away. Some piano, it's very hard to connect, you know, sometimes really long time to be good friends. Uh, but this piano and I became friends right away, so I love this piano. But last time, uh, Austin, my junior, he came here, he told me it's time to buy a new one. You know, it's like, really? And, you know, kind of makes me sad. This is my piano, but I haven't got a new one anyway. So, but I wish I had chance to tune my piano. So, you know, I'm every day I'm worried. He's kind of old, old guy and I'm kind of pushing him every day. Since I'm home every day now and I'm all day long, I'm playing only this piano. So he's like, man, you gotta be, you know, you gotta take it easy. You know, <laughs> I feel like he's like, okay, <laughs> you're pushing me. And I don't want to push him too much because I'm afraid I'm gonna hurt him, you know? But this is the piano I, I play. I have one Yamaha uh, upright piano downstairs, but it's it's really bad. Uh, even I haven't tuned that for a while. So I want to play this piano so much, but I'm afraid I'm gonna hurt him. So especially low one notes. I told you guys earlier last week. G and G flat, same notes. G flat. So I try not to play that note. G, lower G because it's really out of tune. So that's another challenge for me. So try not to play that note, skipping it or play really soft. Um, yeah, a lot of challenges I have to, <laughs> but it's good. I just wanted to, you know, share this story, my piano story, but I love you. I love you. I don't want to hurt. Um, so I want to play something else. Um, next song is by Duke Ellington. I got it bad and that ain't good.
hope you guys are enjoying that. Um, you know, right now, usually I'm playing a second set at the Mad Monkfish. Um, amazing uh, restaurant has great food and I can eat sushi there every Friday. I miss it so much. And also they have my uh, signature drink there. It's called Yoko Miwa's Peach Perfect. So usually I, I ask people, are you drinking my drink? My signature drink? So you can make your own drink or just drink champagne or you know, my drink is based on champagne. So you can just drink champagne or drink wine for me, which is my favorite, red wine, anything. I like Cabernet though. Um, so I'm gonna play next song is by Ivan Lins. Um, he's one of my favorite Virgin um, musician, musicians. Uh, he's amazing composer, uh, singer, and pianist. Uh, probably he plays other instruments too. Uh, but this one is everybody's favorite. So you can sing along. I cannot hear you, but probably you can sing along. It's called Madalena by Ivan Liz.
Magdalena, did you sing along? I hope so. Okay, now, you want to hear one of my original songs? Do you mind? If I play mine? Uh, she, so, this song is the story about behind, hmm? story behind this song is Several years ago, I had a chance to write a music for an entire movie. It's called Midlife. Um, so, you know, I was a lot of work. Actually, so 40 some music, more than 40 songs I had to write in one month. You know, I thought I'm gonna, <laughs> I don't know, I was so, Hard, like whole months I spent you know one month in the summer in my room all day uh, but it was fun after it's finished it was amazing you know my songs in a movie no the mu uh, movies are on iTunes so if you're interested um, it's called midlife and um, so I wrote lots of songs and one song um, it was actually this song was originally just a bass uh, play, you know, ball. And um, I arranged this song for trio, so you know, longer version actually. And this song was picked by Spotify, one of the uh, what is it called official playlists, uh, coffee table jazz uh, playlist, and. This song itself, um, it's been streamed almost 3 million times uh, since I released this song. So we recorded this song on my latest album, it's called Keep Talking, Yokomiya Trio, uh, Keep Talking. So this song is called Sunshine Follows the Rain, so you can Google or Oh, by the way, you can go to my website, just my name, yokomiya.com. So you can see a lot of information there. Uh, also, you can join, uh, you can sign up for on my um, email list. So we send out this, you know, <laughs> the schedule right now, but our, you know, what's going on with me, you know, kind of stuff. So it's fun. Please sign up on my email if you're interested. But I'm going to play this song. Um, one of my original songs is called Sunshine Falls the Rain.
Sunshine for the Rain by me. <laughs> um, now I want to say I want to say hi, hi, hello to um, Ahmad Jamal, one of my heroes. Oh, I heard he was uh, watching my live stream in last week, and uh, he might be watching tonight too. That makes me really nervous, so I try not to think about it. But I'm, I'm honored if he's watching it. Um, I was gonna mention um, a lot of musicians doing live streaming right now, which is great. And you know, somebody uh, like Chick Korea, he's doing his live streaming on his um, his room. Probably it's like his recording studio or something, you know. Um, beautiful Yamaha piano, and he has other, you know, keyboard set, uh, sitting around, um, you know, a bunch of stuff I can see. Uh, but he's interesting. He's he's very casual, you know. He's just playing something, and like uh, he's been practicing, you know, like Gershwin or a children's song, you know. And then he's like, oh, you know, I should play one more time, you know, I should, I should play slower and let me try again, <laughs> you know, it's kind of unbelievable. You can watch, he is practicing, you know, I love it. Um, Fred Hush, he's doing every day, a uh, tiny concert too. And who else? Michael McDonald, he was doing the live streaming the other day, uh, almost made me cry. That was awesome, awesome. He's playing keyboard and he's singing. Oh, he's playing it. It's really good, man. Very impressive. So you can, you know, also you can let me know. Somebody else doing it, I should know. I should check it out. Um, so I guess I have one more song, right? Um, I hope you guys are enjoying it. And um, I'm going to play the song we recorded on our uh, latest album, Keep Talking Again. Uh, this is uh, Boogie, Stop, Boogie Stop Shuffle by Charles Mingus.
much for tuning in. And thank you so much for listening. You know what? I told you last week, but I cannot speak and play at the same time. That's why I don't sing. I sing through my hands. <laughs> Maybe I should try. Maybe I can sing. Maybe I can talk a little bit. Only three chords. But anyway, I want to say thank you so much to many, many people. You know, um, especially M, M Bracewit. Uh, M Bracewit. She's been working so hard for us and for many years, but you know, she promoted this live streaming and it's listed so many places because of Anne. Thank you so much, Anne. Love you. And oh, my new manager, Laura. Laura. Hey, hey, Jamal. Oh my gosh. I hope you're watching it. And Martin Hamill. And my new level, Ubuntu Music. Ubuntu Music. And whoa. Eric Jackson, yes, he shared this information on his page on Facebook. I really appreciate it. She's, he's been so supportive. Um, so, WBGO and Downbeat Magazine, um, they mentioned my streaming gig <laughs> on Downbeat Magazine uh, online uh, article. That's amazing uh, because of the end. Um, stereo file and Chris Sampson and the Unity Stage. Thank you so much. And Jason Crane and the Jazz Session. And JT, of course, JT. And Jamie Chantula, Jamie, the Mad Monkfish, and Liz Zigomat. And of course, you guys, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you for tuning in and watching it and listening. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, so I have my website, um, you know, you can uh, see what's going on. I have a lot of stuff there, so check it out. And if you are not, um, connected on Facebook, uh, Yokomiya Trio. You can like my Trio page too. I do Instagram. I couldn't figure out uh, do Facebook and Instagram together. I guess I have to have two phones, right? I forgot to play. 